Hi, I'm Justin, DevOps engineer, and I switched from CentOS Linux to Ubuntu Linux. For more reviews like these, please click the link below. CentOS Linux and Ubuntu Linux are free to use, very extensible, and have no licensing costs. They're a great base for any company that wants to use Linux as a base for their products or as a base for a server or a desktop OS. Ubuntu Linux is best for its widespread community. Over the years, its market share has grown to the point where it's become the de facto standard for many different emerging technologies, like Docker and many different types of software development activities. CentOS Linux is best if you want absolute rock-solid stability. CentOS releases are very, very similar from one minor release to the next, and each major release only happens every couple of years. Each major release is supported for a number of years, and so if you want something that just works and you want it to largely stay that way for a large number of years, CentOS Linux is your best bet. CentOS Linux's documentation isn't really the best, but since CentOS is essentially the same thing as Red Hat Enterprise Linux, if you look at the documentation for that, it's really simple to get started. Red Hat has some of the best documentation available. For Ubuntu Linux, Ubuntu is a little bit more community-based, like I said before, so a lot of it is you'll find community-sourced help articles. A lot of the times these work, but they may not always use the most up-to-date technology, so in both cases you'll probably find the information you want. CentOS has more professionally curated resources than Ubuntu. When looking for this software, it's important to consider the trajectory of both products. CentOS Linux started off as a essentially a rebuild of Red Hat Enterprise Linux. It had the same sort of support, it was supported for 10 years per release, and it was a great base for a lot of server admins, including myself. However, Red Hat has decided to essentially kill the traditional version of CentOS Linux. Now, they're pushing you towards CentOS Stream, which is not a rebuild of Red Hat Enterprise Linux, but is the open source upstream for it. So essentially, it is a perpetual test for the upcoming release of Red Hat Enterprise Linux. So I would not consider CentOS to be an enterprise-grade product any longer. It's great if you have Red Hat Enterprise Linux stuff that you want to test the new releases for. It's not really a great base any longer, though. Ubuntu, by comparison, has grown in market share over the years to t overtake, in large part, the combined market share of Red Hat plus Red Hat Enterprise Linux. Ubuntu is widely used in the cloud, it has great integrations with Docker, and it has great support in the community. All in all, Ubuntu is probably the better product long-term-wise as compared to CentOS Linux.